fan, Chi Town Ken here, along with dancing t hooligan. <coughs> Not hooligan. <coughs> with Tommy Celsius. And I just want to know, myself and on behalf of the fans, what are you thinking? What is going through that head of yours, and what makes you think that you have the right to belittle these people, the people that are paying your way? First off, Ken, I am not a hooligan. I am not a dancer. I am just simply Tommy. Simply Tommy Celsius. I come from the great state of Delaware. I also come from the great state of Maine, two of the purest states in the United States of the all 50. So you're simply Tommy from Delaware and Massachusetts. No, Delaware and Maine. OK, Delaware and Maine. Yes. The okay. People's Republic of Delaware and Bangor, Maine. The People's Republic of Massachusetts? The People's Republic of Delaware. All right, let's see if we can't iron this out, because it keeps changing. The People's Republic of Delaware and Bangor, Maine. That is correct. Simply Tommy. Simply. Okay. And I tell you this right now. You want to know, and these people, these people want to know why and what is going on in this noggin. That'd be right. This one right here. What's there of it, yes. I'm going to tell you this right now. Take a look into the eyes, because the eyes are the window to the soul, and they also tell about, a lot about a man's brain. You people have coasted for the last 50-some-odd years on things like welfare, SSI, disabilities, and I, as a God-fearing American who pays my taxes, am sick and tired of you people coasting through life. Now, wait a minute, Simply Tommy. There are people that need those services or they will not survive. You know, they have remote islands for people like that, and I have purchased one personally that I will ship every single one of you that cannot make it or make the grade <laughs> here in society. I will send you there personally, care of my boat. You want to know, <laughs> know what the name of my boat is? Not really. Amistad. My boat, Amistad. I will send you there personally on my boat, Amistad, to that faraway island so you people can... Euphonize each other, possibly live off the land, live off each other if you know what I mean, Ken, because there's a zombie army and you can't harm me somewhere out there. So if I understand this right, simply Tommy from the People's Republic of Delaware, Delaware. and Bangor Maine, Bangor, Maine, you are on a crusade to take people that are less fortunate than you and put them on your boat called uh, who knows whatever it was, and this is your gift to society. What I am doing is I am doing the upper echelon of society a favor by cutting those that desire to sit and do nothing, yet collect the money that I work hard for, and that most of the people, my people, work hard for. So guess what? Starting tonight, DeMarcus, yes, you and I have fought each other. And I'm going to tell you this. If you can win tonight, it's all said and done. All over. And I'll reinstate this so the people can understand it. But tonight, if you pin me, one, two, three. One, two, three. You won't have to hear from me ever again because you and I, we won't be able to touch each other. You as a commissioner ought to be able to appreciate that. Oh, I think I can find that. Answer me a question, though, something you said. Or maybe I should ask it in a different way. I've never seen anybody of upper echelon wearing an Atari T-shirt. How do you explain this? This is vintage. And this comes from a finest vintage shop that you will ever see in Bangor, Maine. 
And this shirt, I was able to talk the man down from $350 all the way down to $75. This is made of some fine cashmere cloth, and it's very, very, very expensive. And it needs ironing. Uh, folks, I, I don't know what else to say, but simply Tommy. Ladies and gentlemen, Tommy Celsius. Sound like they love you. Since the production company can't get things right, I guess that I will step in because you people deserve to hear from me. Tonight again, Demarcus James, Demarcus James is sticking his nose out and he says that he's ready to go. He says, I tried to break his arms. Demarcus, we all know the reason that you weren't here last week is because you were down in Harlem trying to figure out the mystery of the most confusing holiday and that's Father's Day. Uh, that's not very nice. I think you might ought to apologize, huh? I don't have to apologize for anything, Mike. I don't have to apologize for me, but I really should apologize for the way that all these people are dressed tonight. Uh, did you happen to look in the mirror at yourself? You got something to say? You got something to say? Yeah, I got something to say. I'm not supposed to be here tonight because you almost broke my arm two weeks ago. But you know what? I signed the, the contract to be here, so I'm here. Tonight is still me and you tonight, one-on-one. -on -one. You're not getting off that easy, Tommy. I told you that before. You had your punk boy, Schaefer, come out here and stick his nose in our match two weeks ago. And last week, last week, shut your mouth, I'm talking right now. And last week, last week you weren't here, and I know for a fact that there's about 20 Bebe's kids running around Harlem waiting to call you daddy. Just live up to it and tell Schaefer to keep his nose out of my business. After tonight, you're going to be calling me daddy, just like them baby kids you're talking about. So you better get ready. All the talk is going to end tonight, Tommy, so be ready. That's perfectly fine. You and me, DeMarcus, are going to go again tonight, and I'm going to prove to these people that I'm smarter than them, I'm craftier than them, I'm well-dressed, I'm just that much better than you people. You can talk all you want, Tommy, but you still got to get in this ring with me tonight. By hook or by crook, whatever it takes, I'm going to get you tonight. It's one-on-one. -on -one. No chair tonight. There's not going to be no chair to save you tonight. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, Tommy Celsius, and ladies and gentlemen, Demarcus James.
Oh my, oh my, BCW all in ya. It's the boy said he said, the voice of BCW wrestling with the man that drives me absolutely crazy, Matt E. 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 Legit, legit. Matthew E. Legit is here to bear witness. Hear ye, hear ye. All of you dirty, degenerate, Welfare collecting, oh, social security cheating, fraudsters in North Portland. You are about to witness oh. one of the greatest professional wrestlers the Pacific Northwest has ever seen, simply Tommy Celsius. Oh, here you go with Tommy. Destroying your welfare hero, your Oregon Trail Card King, Demarcus Trail James. Trail Card King. Wow, are you something else? This man, Demarcus James, has had Tommy Celsius numbers for seven weeks. Are you in denial? You got a little amnesia? I thought you were a lot sharper than that, man. Well, anyone who wants to can go back and look at the facts of the matter oh, at youtube.com slash legit pro wrestling. And they'll see that Tommy Celsius has been cheated by Demarcus James. Oh, wow. But really? that he is clearly the dominant force in the Northwest today. Go back and see that lie, ladies and gentlemen. And because look, Tommy Celsius wearing a vintage Club Stud International shirt from his Northwest Wrestling Alliance days. You can check that out at YouTube.com slash Legit Pro Wrestling as well. Yeah, but you know what? I mean, look at the lime green. I mean, the man looks like... I love that look. You like that? It looks it like, looks like a, a big old Looks like a big old slice of key lime pie. Yeah, I bet he does. Man, you Tommy should look at that real nice. He probably got a pair like, like that, don't you? I like that color. That I looks like, nice on Tommy. I like your pants, too. Look like you got a matching pair on, man. I do. Look real nice. I right wear the there. short version though. Jeez, He's yeah. wearing the long pants. I'm wearing the short pants. How it is? Y'all hang out too? You hang we out hang out on a regular basis when I'm not hanging out with my good friends, the Moonshine Brothers. Well, that's nice. And I'm not chilling with the Buddy Highway or uh, good old Kelly Schaefer down there in Oregon City. I'm hanging out with what might be the most dominant force in professional wrestling well, in 2012. Simply Tommy Celsius. I hear you, simply Tommy Celsius. Here it is, Demarcus James right here. Been going a few weeks now. Tommy Celsius tried to take Demarcus James out of wrestling. Did you see that movie Hustle and Flow? Yes, I did. Is that the guy he slapped in the bathroom Wait at the man, end? That 200 <laughs> pounds, I think that is Skinny Black. You're trying to be funny. You're trying to be funny calling Demarcus James Skinny Black. You know what? I don't think he's going to take a liking to what you just said about him. But what I will tell you, Matt, is that Demarcus James is on Tommy Celsius. And you know what? Tommy Celsius wants and Tommy match. double axe handle from behind doing yeah. whatever it takes. Yeah, that's to get dirty. rid of Demarcus that's, early in this matchup. That's the dirty as we kick it off. Look at the rapid shots from Tommy Celsius. He's a man on fire. I he is Denzel Washington. Yeah, I don't know if he is Denzel Washington, but he is a man that's mad. I mean, if a man's beat you a thousand times, wouldn't you want to beat him at least once? What are you talking about? Look at those. Look at Ooh. those nice tight fists to yeah, the closeness. jawbone. Hey, I gotta get admit. I mean, you know, Marcus. I gotta admit though. Tommy Celsius is getting off to a, a whopping start, kicking us off here at BCW opening match here. What else will we start out with, Demarcus? Huge James. clothesline. Yeah, nice clothesline, man. You, you better believe it. You are all over him right now. I mean, my God, look at this guy. You know what? He calls these people. He disrespects these people. The champ is here. Through, yeah. through. The champ is here. Now you're through, talking. Through. Now you're talking. Well, the Demarcus champ is James Tommy Celsius. Back. Oh, let's go. Where's the belt at? I don't see him with no belt. Oh. He's too busy getting rid of the scrubs. He's too busy cleaning yeah. up the streets. Nice street, not nice strength. I mean, nice tackle there by Tommy Celsius there. Oh, missed that leapfrog. Uh -oh. Hurt his knee. Uh -oh. DeMarcus is in trouble. And now uh -oh. watch my close personal friend, your hero. You people out there should pay attention because this is what happens when you oh. mess with a real man you know, like Tommy Celsius. When you try to take a man out of professional wrestling like Tommy Celsius did, that's what he's trying to do. He's trying to take DeMarcus James back out the game again, but this time for good. And right now, here's what he's trying to do, Matt. You know exactly what his plan is. What Tommy Celsius is trying to do is simply what these people are doing. He's trying to make sure DeMarcus has a legitimate reason to collect his disability check each month. You know what? Tommy Celsius is arrogant. Tommy Celsius because he got a lot of money. Talking about early in the interview that he had a he had a three hundred ninety seventy five and ninety five dollars shirt, the Atari shirt. That's Down true. Seventy five dollars getting a deal. You probably couldn't even find Maine on a map, could you? You know what? Probably a lot of people don't even live there either. And I tell you something right now, but Tommy Celsius don't take nothing away from the veteran man. He is dissecting the Marcus James right now. He is in the zone right now. He's on another level right now. 
He's on a whole nother level, especially with those pants. He's on a whole nother plateau right now, Did you right just now, make Matt. fun of his gear? I didn't make fun of his gear. I just think it's ridiculous for a man to wear lime green pants to the wrestling ring. You know why he wears those lime green pants? Why does he wear them? Because nobody's got the guts to say to his face that he looks like half a you-know-what. Well, you know what? It is because what it is. Because he'd slap the taste out of your mouth if you had the guts to say it to his face, Cedric, and man, you know it. It is what it is, man. All I'm simply saying is if he's simply Tommy Celsius, then simply Tommy Celsius need to try to get a win tonight because it's going to be hard. I don't care what you do to Marcus James. He's going to come back every time. DeMarcus has not had one bit of offense in this whole match. Not yet. Not yet. And right now. And he's not going to. I mean, there is finally something. Got to get a little something in here. Come on, DeMarcus. Get a little something in. Give him the business, baby. Nice drop kick by DeMarcus James. But that wheel, that wheel is That's bad. That's right. It bad is bad. Wheel. It is hurt. Bad wheel, man. I, I'm giving you credit. I'm giving you guy credit. Come on. I'm talking about and it And here's right the now. truth. If DeMarcus James spent a little bit more time going to the gym and training, coming to practice, what? and running those ropes, oh, gosh. you know what? He'd be in better shape. So and stuff like that wouldn't happen when he oh, tries to leapfrog. So you're saying Tommy Sells is in better shape than DeMarcus Look James? Look at the man. Of course he's in better shape. Can you tell me where? Can you point where on the man's body? The entire body. So so what you're saying is that that's, that's the nicest looking man you ever seen. That's what you're saying. Are the you, sexiest man alive, Tommy Sell, Simply Tommy Sells. I wouldn't say. I don't, I don't really know if a man is sexy or not. I mean, I guess... People of your persuasion might know that, Cedric. So, you, <laughs> so what you're saying is that Tommy Sells is in the great best shape of his life, is what you're trying to say. Look at him. He's okay. in the best shape of Demarcus James's life. Oh, here you are. I understand what you're saying right now. Okay, Tommy Sells. Is, I see what you're doing right now, and I'll tell you something right now. If he keeps on working that leg like that, this nice, match may be yes, over. This yes. match may be over right now. That spinning toe hold, that one of the one of the one, just one of the maneuvers he learned. When he was down in Amarillo visiting Terry Funk. Oh, man. No, you didn't say Mr. Funk. Hey, that's a lot of credibility. You're talking about Terry Funk. And right now, he has mastered this move right here. And right now, he is trying to take the Marcus James out of professional wrestling. This is what it was all about. It was all about taking him out the game and getting him out of here. And he's a fan favorite. These fans come to see the Marcus James every single week, and how dare you? Of course, you? they probably see probably see each other down on the welfare line when he's not here wrestling. Oh, you're talking about these people again? These he's people, a man of the people. These people are hard These people. These people are hardworking people. These, these people, people are, are hardworking, hard earned money to get in here to see a great show. And without these people, there wouldn't be BCW. I figure, Matt. It, you know, it probably is a lot of hard work Five cheating to gone. get some SSI, uh, some disability. Trying to get workers' compensation when you've only been on the job for six months and you're faking an injury. That's a lot of hard work. You know what? Back to the match here. I cannot believe you, Matt. I mean, you know what? These fans, I mean, they, they are supportive. They're, they're hardworking citizens, and they enjoy their BCW wrestling, but they cannot stand Tommy Celsius as DeMarcus James is mounting another comeback, trying to get some kind of breathing room in this match. And finally, we see DeMarcus James. But can he get him up with that bad wheel? Oh, no, he cannot, Matt. Why are you laughing? It's not funny. It's great. You over here dying laughing right now. This man, this man sitting here, he, he may have his knee bump. This, he may ACA. The whole thing may be shut right now. I hope so. I right hope now. so. And you're sitting it's there about doing damn it. time. Choking the man out right now. T-Rex can't see because somebody else is just blinding the man. This, there you go. Making fun of his wardrobe again. That is, that is the required attire to be a professional wrestler. You I'm wouldn't not, know that, though, because you've never been in the I'm ring, I'm not Cedric. making fun of this. I have been in the ring, actually. You've what? been in the ring with DeMarcus James. Right. Doing your little play fight. Right, but we was in the ring together. I've been in there, man, and then there's nothing nice about me. So you've never in actually been in the ring with a real man. Who's a real man? Well, not DeMarcus James and not you. Oh, here you go. <laughs> You're looking at one in the ring. Somebody man enough to wear lime green trunks. Man, I guess Because it's... nobody's got the scroat to tell him otherwise. Oh, my God. Matt Legit is looking at his idol, the man he idolizes and he thinks about on a 24-hour day basis, Tommy Celsius. Everyone should idolize Tommy Celsius. Everybody, Especially huh? these people in e North Portland. Everybody he's should idolize him. He's a good role him. model, a good example. Uh, oh, a perfect example, right? Huh? If you want a good guy in your life, Look at DeMarcus James right now. That's the man you need to see. The man with the, the fire in his eyes. The man's got the heart of a champion right there. Look at DeMarcus James. He's looking good right now. Oh, got Tommy Celsius in the corner. Nice splash by DeMarcus James. Oh, oh, he's working that leg a little bit, and now he got a Big bulldog. Big face crusher there. A nice bulldog right There's there. A face crusher. Well, oh, face crusher, bulldog, two count. Can he get a three? 
Not oh. a chance. He almost got a three on you, boy. Not a chance. Tommy's playing possum. Man, you know what? These guys, man, they're, putting, they're giving it all they got right now, man. And Hey, 7611 North Exeter. Man, that's what's happening every Sunday. 530, open the door, 6 o'clock bell time. Get down here. Eagles Lodge, it's off the hook. BCW Wrestling. And now Tommy C back in the corner. Oh, DeMarcus missed that time and got that knee again, Looks man. Looks like DeMarcus went to the well one too many times. Oh, no. Tommy rolls him Two. up. No, no, no. This is going to be it. That's you, are it. you freaking? You're kidding me. You see that? I tell you, using the ropes again. This guy right here. I can't. I cannot believe this right here. Using the ropes and T-Rex didn't see a Ringing thing the to bell. get the victory. That's it. It's over. Tommy Celsius, as per usual, kicks the crap out. And what Schaefer. is Kelly doing down yeah, here? Yeah, Kelly's letting him know the leg was on the rope. That's what, what? I'm talking about. Yeah. Tell him what's up. Yeah. Now, he exactly. got his butt kicked by Buddy exactly. Highway last week. And no. now he comes out here this week. No, no, no. Causing no, no, trouble no, no, no. for Red simply Tommy Celsius. T -Rex, what is T-Rex yeah. doing? Restart the match. That's what I'm Are you talking kidding about. me? Yeah, Tommy Celsius trying to cheat to win. Not working tonight. Demarcus James. Oh, look at He got Oh, yes. One, two, three. Yeah, he beat Tommy Celsius. Yeah. It's not possible. Ah, yes. This is not yeah. possible. Yeah. You know what? Tommy Celsius is trying to get over on Demarcus James, but he this time it didn't work. He pulled the trunks. You saw it clear no as day. He right was there. pulling his trunks. Straight up, man to man. And right now, oh, look at Tommy Celsius is throwing a fit in the ring. That's the guy you want to be role model for your kids, huh? Look at this man here rolling around no. the ring like a big old baby. I want that tape review. Demarcus cheated. No, he did not Kelly cheat. Schaefer came down here and screwed up everything. So you met, that's your friend Kelly Schaefer, remember? Well, not anymore. He's not your friend no more? I guess not. Wow. There you see Kelly helping Demarcus. Get off your phone. There you go. Get nice off your Twitter hey, account. It's blowing up, man. It's blowing up right now. Demarcus James. Facebook messages flying into my cell phone right now. Incredible. Tommy Sells is a cheater. Tommy Celsius doesn't what? know anything about Tommy Celsius don't like these people. Tommy Celsius, oh wow, Tommy Celsius everywhere on this Facebook page. You're nuts. What does he got to say? What's your friend got to say? Shut your mouth and listen and you'll find out. <sighs> Another case of faulty officiating here in BCW. Which one of you people bound together your 50 cents a piece to pay him off? Yeah, it wouldn't surprise me Schaefer, if he contributed. Schaefer, you stuck your nose in my business again. Demarcus, this is long from over. You people shut your mouth right now. Don't even bother, Tommy. Next week, Demarcus, I'm gonna give it away for free. On this eve of Independence Day, July 1st, right out in that parking lot right there, you grab yourself Schaefer as a partner. I'll grab me somebody back there because I'm sure that one of them is willing and able to tag with me. And if I have to, I'll fight you all the way out on Lombard, across to the Basket Robins, downtown to St. John's. I may even stop at Patty's home plate for a bite to eat and shove your face in the grill. I'd love to see hey, that, Tommy. Tommy. Hey, Tommy. I got an idea for next week. Demarcus James versus Tommy Celsius in our outside show. Falls count anywhere in the parking lot. You what is Kodiak doing? Match. Get that in big fat slob lot. in the Guess back. What? He shouldn't even we be part of the office in BCW. A tag team match because I want his butt to face the wrath on July 1st, just like he's going to face the wrath. I'll find me a partner. Don't you worry about that. But you make it so. We wanted a tag match. You don't care who he finds. Anyone. Tommy, we don't care who you find. Find a partner if you're that lucky to find one. I don't think you got any friends in this arena or anywhere else on the planet. So good luck finding a partner. We accept. Tommy's got lots no. of friends. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what, Tommy Matt. Tommy Celsius hey. and mystery partner versus Kelly Schaefer, Demarcus James. Shut your big fat mouth, Kodiak. Falls count Go sit in the back. In the parking lot. You falls know what, Matt? 
Doesn't deserve anywhere. to be in an arena with Tommy Not Celsius. None of them do. Because like I Especially said before, you. I'm going to take him all the way down Lombard. I may go to Kelly Point Park, and I may pin you down there. I may take you to downtown St. John's, and I might pick you up right where they picked up that bank robber. Keep talking, Tommy. You ain't got the job done yet. So hopefully you find a partner that you think can help you get the job done. Because I don't think you man enough to get the job done by yourself. I'm plenty man enough. I'm going to get the job done. And like I said before, I'm going to grab me a bite to eat at Patty's home plate. How do you think about that? Hey, what do you say, James and Schaefer against Celsius? And it don't matter. I'm going to tell you something right now, Matt. Hey, false count anywhere. Kelly Schaefer to Marcus James. I'll sign it. Tonight. Guess what? Tommy, Next simply week, Tommy Celsius needs a partner. And he doesn't James have one Bush yet. I don't think he'll get nobody to partner with him. Tommy's got tons of friends. You know, I just might take you down to 8725 North Chautauqua Boulevard and give you an old school whooping. <laughs>